Ooh, it's a bit loud. <laughs> Hopefully, it's not too loud for you guys. Hey guys, Silence Yao here. Welcome to a Facebook live stream. If you guys are watching on YouTube, it means you've missed it. Um, so if you guys want to catch such live streams in the future, make sure you follow me on my YouTube Facebook page. Links in the description down below. Alright, so this is, well, kind of my first, I would say, gonna be my first complete experience with Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Um, I have played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon before on the 3DS, uh, but I didn't really finish it just like most of my Chocobo Dungeon games, they are just too long. Um, so it ends up being kind of a, you know, touch and go. So alright, so I plan to finish this and if things go well, and if guys, if you guys enjoy it as a series, I might do it for my YouTube channel, if not, uh, the demo is gonna be a one shot and that's it. So I can play the game on my own time and own pace. Alright, so let's do this. I'm loving the illustration style. It's got a picture book style um, of design. It, it really reminds me of Winnie the Pooh, 100 Acre Woods. Uh, you know, the classic Winnie the Pooh storybook novels. The illustration really is the kind of feeling. So let's go. I wonder which Pokemon I will be. So from the past experience, basically, what they, they ask you a few questions and based on what you answer, they will just make you that Pokemon. Welcome! This is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. But before I can let you through, I have several questions for you. There we go, so this is what we are here for. Basically to find out what Pokemon I will become. I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Okay! Let the interview begin. Ooh, sparkly! There is a bucket. If you put water in it, how much will you fill it? Huh. Um, obviously full, I suppose? Do you get the feeling that you've slowed down lately? Um, not really. My, my life is pretty ful fulfilling. <laughs> Being a YouTuber and all that, it's, it's, it's always busy. So I would say no. Do you often yawn? Definitely yes. It's a tiring full-time job plus YouTubing. Definitely a very sleepy. Do others often call you childish? I don't know. But I myself personally feel that I tend to be youthful, I would say. Not childish, but uh, I, I guess if you want to put it in that kind of terms, I suppose so. It's the summer festival. Do you like carnivals? Uh, I guess I do if I have time to go for them. You know? Yeah. Your friend fails to show up for a meeting at the promised time. What do you do? Oh, I, I definitely get irritated. <laughs> uh, but I do wait for them. You know, but you know... I mean, if it does happen very frequently, I guess I will be very irritated. Then, of course, if it goes way beyond frequent, I will get angry and bail. But normally, on first-time basis, I will definitely wait patiently. Alright. Can you go into a haunted house? Uh... No. <laughs> uh, mainly because, well, I think a lot of people, a lot of you guys probably don't know. Um, yeah, I kind of have a sixth sense, or rather a half-open eye if you guys uh, know what I'm talking about, so I'm very sensitive to spirits, so definitely not. Hmm, can you sincerely thank someone when you feel grateful? Yeah, I, I do it all the time, so do you want to play as a boy or girl? Okay, this is very straightforward, but... Like all games, I always play as the opposite gender because I would like to see my character as something that I like to enjoy viewing. So yeah, go! You appear to be 
So, how many Pokemon are there that you can become? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. 16 different types of Pokemon. So, depending on the questions you answer, I guess you become one of the 16. The Jolly type? Hey! <laughs> Always laughing and smiling, you will uplift everyone around you. Uh, that's what I intend to, and I hope I am doing. So, you love jokes? Definitely. <laughs> You have lots of friends, uh, I guess so, I don't know, and you're popular wherever you go. Uh, this is, I don't know, I, I don't know, I don't know really, but yeah, you guys tell me. <laughs> but sometimes you get carried away and say things that get you in trouble. Yeah, this is definitely on point. This, this is definitely on point. Um, I guess both are correct in a way, I get a lot of friends at the same time. I hurt them, and then they leave me, that kind of I don't know, life is harsh. You should learn to think before saying or doing anything. Uh, well, I, I think I have, over the years, grow, becoming an adult. <laughs> A jolly person like you should be... Hey, I got a Totodile! You appear to be the Pokemon Totodile, is that correct? Uh... I guess so? <laughs> I mean, I, I don't really dislike Totodao. I mean, I would definitely like to be something else, but I guess Totodao is okay. You know, uh, that's fine. Let's go with it. This is the final step. Who would you like to have as a partner? Choose your Pokemon you want as your partner from this group. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go with Eevee because Eevee is definitely my favorite among the remaining few. So, yeah. Eevee? Yeah. Should your partner be a boy or a girl? Um. <clears throat> I guess a girl? But. Oh! So I'm a female Totodile and my partner Eevee can be a boy or a girl? Oh! Okay, let's have it. Let's have Evie as a boy. Yeah. What is your partner's nickname? A, a name for Evie? E Evelyn, I guess. How do you spell Evelyn? <laughs> I have no idea. Eve. I guess Eve would sound nice. Um. Let's 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 go with Eve. Yeah, e Eve the Eevee. Alright. I'm good. Yeah. Wait. Eevee's a boy, right? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Uh, is it normal to have a guy called Eve? Um. Wait, let me choose again. Wait, I can choose what I want to be? Oh, that's so cool. Now, I'm gonna stick with Totodao because that's what I got. Uh, okay, so I, I'll, I'll pick Totodao as what they chose for me. Um, I'm, I'm just gonna have everything done the same way, just that like I'm gonna give Eevee a proper boy's name, I suppose. Yeah, here we go, Eevee. I, I, okay, so Ivan, I, I don't know. Uh,. What would a name be good for? Nah, I guess let's let's stick with just not naming them, okay? <laughs> Alright, so here we go. Finally, we can start our adventure. Yeah! Let's go! Let's get you into the world of Pokemon. Go for it, alright. Where am I? Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from somewhere. I wonder who it is. Dot 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 dots. Lots of dots. Excuse me? Please wake up. 
Come on, wake up. Oh. You're finally awake. Great. Uh. Yeah, it looks like we need a pool artwork though. <laughs> uh, wh wh where is this? You were passed out here. I'm glad to see you awake. I'm Evie. Glad to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around before. Huh? You say you're a human? But you look like a normal total down in every way. <laughs> the animation is so cute. Uh, it it's true! I've turned into a total down! But why? I don't remember anything. Um you're kind of weird. Your name? What's your name? Um, my name? Uh, that's right, my name is... Uh, um, okay, I'm gonna change it to... Since I'm a girl, I guess I'll go with my female nickname this time round. So... It's Cecile. There we go. Yeah! Oh! Well... It's a funny name. Thanks, I guess. Somebody? Please! Help me! Huh? I hear shouts from over there. Oh, it's a Butterfree. Uh, what, what's wrong? It's horrible! My canopy fell into a cavern. My poor baby. Oh, what? A huge fissure opened in the ground, and my canopy fell in. He's too young to crawl out by himself. When I went to get my baby, Pokemon suddenly attacked me. Huh? You were attacked? By other Pokemon? They must be enriched by the fissure and are out of control. That's that's what I think. I'm not strong enough to fend off those wild Pokemon. What will become of my baby? Oh, what am I to do? Oh dear, oh dear. This sounds bad. We have to go help. Wait, I I just became a total doll. I have no idea how to use my powers. Um, I don't think it's a good idea. Oh. Could this be a mystery dungeon? It is? It's a mystery dungeon. A mystery dungeon is truly a mysterious place. Hence the name mystery dungeon. Oh god. <laughs> the layout and the items change every time you enter. You can proceed by using the stairs, but you have to find the stairs first. And you remember that Butterfree said Pokemon in a dungeon attack, right? If necessary, we have to fight. Let's do our best. Okay. So, I, oh, I can use the standard buttons instead of the joystick. That's pretty good. Since it's a... Uh, well, a dungeon-style game, it is better not to use the joystick. So how do I attack? So use a move with A. A. Ice Fang. Oh, cool. Wait. How do I know what attacks do I have? So Z and R is shortcuts. Um. Oh. Okay. So the red dots on the map are Pokemon, I guess? I can see one moving towards me. Oh, it's... Hello. Are you coming in? Hello. Ow! Ow! Whoa! Was it possible for Pokemon to attack from the second row in the past? Okay, so I, I do have two different types of moves. Um, I can't switch leaders now. What? Okay, so... How do I see what moves I have? Okay... Move settings. 
Oh! Oh, there we go. Oh! So if I press Z and L, and I press the respective buttons, I get to use different moves? Wow! Okay, I can see Eevee's movesets as well. Oh, so that's pretty handy. So I've got a steel move, a water move, an ice move, and a normal move. So that's pretty versatile, I suppose. Hmm. Okay. I, I get the gist of it. So do I heal life as I walk as well, like in the past? Here's the stairs. I guess we're going down. Yeah. Oh. Yellow is us. Teammates are green. Items are blue. Enemy Pokemon are red. Stairs are white. Okay. Okay, so... Ah, okay, so if I hold down ZL, I can see what moves I want to use. So that's pretty handy. Um, I guess... Water Gun. There we go. So we've got money. Poké is the money of this world. You can use it when you want to buy something. Alright, so let's save up. Okay, we've got more items. We've got berries. Did, did Eevee just steal the berry from me? Eat an Oran Berry to restore HP. To eat one, press X to open the menu. X? Huh? Press X to open the X menu. What? Why did they have to repeat that? Just, just omit the second X and put it as open the menu. And then select back. Okay. Uh... Nothing at the far end here. <laughs> I did, I just push Eevee away and he goes into a 360 spin. <laughs> That's funny as hell. Okay. Press L for auto mode. What? That's the auto mode now? Oh god, you can have it play by itself. Holy crap, that is so useful. That's... It'll probably help me out as much as, you know... Considering that I don't have a lot of time to play and it's 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 definitely gonna be beneficial for me, especially for a person who doesn't have a lot of time. A game that auto plays itself, but of course you you definitely have to have your team as powerful as it is to have it auto run. So yeah. Alright, so um Sunken, uh, we need to use an ice move because you know plants. Super effective, yeah? Alright. Let's move on. Hello to whoever's watching on the live stream. Alright. Okay, so nothing in this area. Let's go hunt for those items. Uh, blue blue dots are the items. Alright, we've got more money. Oh, 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 hello. Whoa, Eevee, violent. Whoa, thank you, Eevee. Alright, moving on. Okay, we've got more Poké here. So the stairs is missing. Or oh, oh, oh wait, the stairs was where we were <laughs> originally. Okay. Moving on. Oh, I saw execute. Should we should we go and disturb him? Is there a way to target the enemy? Is that yeah? Is there a way to target the enemy? Oh yeah, there we go. Um, Ice Fang. Yeah, everything dies with one hit. <laughs> Eevee, <laughs> you look so funny spinning 360. <laughs> oh, there it is, the canopy. Mummy, where are you? We came to rescue you. Yeah. Huh? Your mom's waiting, let's get you out. Okay. Alright, there goes the tutorial stage. Hopefully this doesn't end the demo. Oh my goodness, it'll be a very short demo. <laughs> my baby's safe. I'm sorry, I don't know how you, I could ever thank you properly. Oh, that's okay. It has been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fissures like that one. 
It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Please, may I have your names at least? I'm Evie. And this is a sale. Oh my god, Katami is sparkling, oh god. <laughs> and the animation of his, um, you know, the picture that you see at the bottom where he's conversing. Oh, that's so adorable. <laughs> cool. <laughs> he's, uh, staring at me adoringly. <laughs> Those sparkly eyes, it's a little embarrassing. Yeah, but it's, it's so cute. Oh god, you... You cannot ignore a cute canopy. But this doesn't feel bad either. It's like I'm a hero? Yeah. Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience. Thank you, Eevee and Cecile. I know it isn't really enough, but this is a token of our thanks. Please accept it. You got a tiny reviver seat? Oh. Oh, Pekka Berry! Hey, we got 500 Poke! I feel like we're robbing the Butterfree. <laughs> Thank you so much, goodbye! Don't say goodbye, I want to see you guys again! Thank you for helping. You're very tough. I was sure impressed. So, what are you gonna do? Do you have any plans? Listen... If you don't have a place to stay, you should come with me. Okay. So we just follow Eevee like that without giving a nod. Well, this is the place. Wow. I can't explain, but I'm happy. <laughs> I'm a human being, but I like this place. I feel weirdly happy. No, you're, you're no longer human, you're becoming a Pokemon permanently. A Pokemon are just generically happy. <laughs> well, th that's what I see from the anime though. So, I don't know. It might be an instinct thing for a Pokemon. Yeah, that's why I suspect as well. Maybe this is what it feels like to want to wag your tail. It doesn't matter, I'm happy. Maybe I feel that way because I'm a Totodile. Wait, you're sparkling! Oh my god, Totodile's eyes are sparkling! <laughs> oh, so Cecil, you're impressed, aren't you? I thought so. I thought this would make a good place for you to live. I was sure you would like it. This is your mailbox? Yeah, yeah I can see that. They deliver mail from other Pokemon here. Because of those disasters, many Pokemon are suffering. You know, just like the Fissure Caterpie uh, fell into. For some reason, there have been many natural disasters lately. I want to help Pokemon in these tough times. I want to help change things so all Pokemon can live in peace. 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 Oh my goodness, what? Uh, so, uh, well, I like how you handled yourself when we rescued Caterpie. Would you like to join me on a rescue team? With you, I think we could be the world's best rescue team. How about it? So, it's not Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, it's Pokemon Rescue Team. <laughs> I don't know. Perfect, that's it then. We are partners in our rescue team from now on. Glad to have you. The team name... Uh, well, I don't have one yet. So, what do you think would be a good name? Courage? No. Um, I don't know, what would be a good team name? We are rescuing people, so... Uh... How many letters do we have? So, two, four, six, eight. Nine, nine letters. So, hero is five letters. Um, so we have nine spaces to use. I don't know. What should I? What? What would be a good nickname for the team? 
Uh, okay, I'm gonna go with just rescue. I suppose. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Is rescue okay? Yeah. I like it, it's a good name, it's perfect! Oh, and one more thing. I, I wanted to wear this on the day I got started on the rescue team. I have two of them, so let's put them on. Alright, we put on a scarf. Oh, it's green! Haha! <laughs> Looks great! You wear it well. Don't you feel focused like we're on the same team together? Rescue team rescue- <laughs> Uh, I probably should have picked something else because I didn't know they would add rescue team in the front. Uh, that's just that's just too hilarious. <laughs> rescue team rescue. <laughs> Let's do good starting tomorrow. Oh well. <laughs> oh, this is so adorable. And that is how. Yes, yeah, Cecile and Evie began their careers together. As a rescue team. Oh, that's it! That's the end of the demo! Oh wow, that was a lot shorter than expected. But anyways guys, what do you guys think of the artwork? What do you guys think of the gameplay? Um, it is just a tutorial level. So, I don't know. Oh, is there more? The next morning. Oh, there is more! I guess we're going on! <laughs> I'm still the same. The way I look, I'm still a total down. But why would I be transformed into a Pokemon? Hmm, I don't understand this at all. Oh, that's right! That Pokemon. Uh, I think it was Eevee? We made a promise to form a rescue team together. I wonder what Eevee is doing. I should go find her. Him! <laughs> I forgot Eevee's a boy. <laughs> I'm the her. <laughs> Eevee, why are you sleeping outside? Oh my goodness, the mailbox is full. Huh? Uh, oh no! <laughs> Sorry. I was so excited I came out here at dawn to wait for you. I must have snoozed off. Anyway, today marks the start of our rescue team. Let's always do our best. Oh, okay. Uh, but, um, we don't have any job offers yet. <laughs> Look at the mailbox, you, you, you sleepy Eevee. It's just right beside you, it's, it's bursting out with letters. Oh yeah! Maybe there's something in the mail for You obviously can see there's something there, Eevee. What's wrong with you? The mailbox contained a rescue team starter set. What? What's a rescue team starter set? <laughs> I knew it'd be there. It's the rescue team starter set. They always give you one if you start a rescue. Who knew that we were starting a rescue team? Who sent it to us? Oh my goodness. Are, are people spying on us? Oh wait, not people. Pokemon spying on us? Eevee opened the rescue team starter set. There was a rescue team badge inside. There was a toolbox inside too. There was also an issue of Pokemon news inside. Yes! There are some good things here. First off, the rescue team badge. It shows that we're... Re okay. Yeah, this is a toolbox. Yeah, I know what a toolbox is. Use it to carry items you find in dungeons. Let's put the stuff Butterfree gave us in here for now. Items are very useful, so let's use them on our adventures. And finally, a, cop a copy of the Pokemon News. It's useful for rescue teams. I'll put the Pokemon News in the mailbox. You should read it later. If you put it in the mailbox, it's gonna be full. And people cannot send us their requests. Eevee, what are you doing? 
Anything else? Is there any other mail? Maybe not. But the mailbox was empty. Okay, so there isn't any mail for us after all. I mean, we are new. We have to advertise our rescue team. We have to make our names known so that people uh, will come look for us if they need help. If there were any rescue jobs, we would be getting mail. But nobody knows about us. See, I, I mentioned it all before even you talked about it. <laughs> uh, uh, something's flying towards us. Oh, I wonder what it could be. Hey, is that our mailman? It is our mailman. <laughs> hey, we got our first mail! Maybe it's a rescue job offer. What does it say? I heard about you from Caterpie. Hey, there we go! Please, we need your help. Magnemite is in trouble. A strange electromagnetic wave flowed through a dungeon and it stopped Magnemite and Mag... Right? Magnemite and Magnemite. So they became Magneton? Oh wait, they are short of one Magnemite. <laughs> okay, that isn't enough to form. Yeah, there! I, I knew it! It wasn't enough to form a Magneton because you need three Magnemites. Uh, Pokemon. <laughs> Alright, it's not complete the way it is now. Please, we need help. Magnemite's friend. So. Can we get this friend to join the other two Magnemites to become a Magneton? Hmm... <laughs> what do you think? Do you think we should go? Uh, we, we are not doing anything, so I guess so? That's the spirit, let's do our best! So adorable. Whoa! Thunder Wave Cave. Has a nice ring to it. Oh, you are here. My friends are in this cavern. My friends should be on the basement sixth floor. Please help them. So, I'm gonna have a problem here because I'm a water type. If if the entire cave is electric types, I think we might need to have EV be a leader because I I'm definitely going to faint. Wait. There's dashing? Was this possible in the past? Whoa! That is fast! Oh my goodness. If your belly is feeling empty, eat an apple to recover. If your belly reaches zero, your HP will go down every time you take a move. Whoa, now there's hunger in this game. You can press B to open your toolbox. It's quicker than going from the X menu. Okay. I'm pressing B. There we go. So, oh, the hunger is that circle with the 95 in it. Okay. Uh, so I'll take note of that. Alright, so I'm gonna see. So, Rattata, so just use a normal move, move I suppose. Oh, Eevee took damage. Oh no. Okay, so we do recover HP after every battle. So we do recover HP as well when we walk, so that's that's good to know. Okay, picking up the item. Alright, alright, let's move. There's a Voltorb here. Okay, I, I'm a bit scared. Okay, let's go with Metal Claw. Hey, there we go. The power of teamwork, so I don't get a super effective damage from the Voltorb, so that's pretty nice. I gotta say the loading time is so fast. I'm pretty happy with how the demo is. If the real game is like this, this is gonna be a fantastic remake of the game. Or other games, because it's two games in one. If you face multiple enemies at once, retreat to a corridor to fight them one at a time. I would, but Eevee will move to my position if I'm not wrong. So let's try that. Oh! Oh, apparently not! 
Oh! So, it's it's a bit different from Chocobo Dungeon, um, where if you move backwards, your partner from the back will move to the front of where you're standing, so they will end up being damaged. So, I guess that spinning EV360 thing is useful in a way. <laughs> so yeah, for every one move you make in a dungeon, your opponent will also make one move. Turns always go in order. On the other hand, if you don't move, neither you or neither will your opponents take your time and choose your actions wisely. Yeah. So okay. We're gonna have to knock out. There we go. Alright. So nice preemptive damage. Fantastic. So we avoid taking the super effective. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Let's do a fast forward. Hold R and use L to walk dagger. Now you tell me. Okay. That was very handy. So I guess it's good to go through the tutorials. Oh wait. But now Eevee is behind one square from me. Hold down ZL to choose the move. Oh yeah, we already found out about it. So let's do this. Oh, he missed. Nice. Alright. If you're in a dungeon and fail in your adventure, you lose all the items and Pokem Poke if you're carrying any. Oh my goodness, that is horrible. But that's expected of a dungeon dungeon brawler, I guess. Huh. Alright, let's go pick up the items. Oh we found the stairs immediately. Thanks Eevee for making it. Oh, Oh, Eevee knocked him out. Oh, poor Plusso. Okay. So we've got more enemies coming in. We got a Rattata. Oh, Water Gun is a long range. Nice. What is this? When you step on a Wonder Tower in the dungeon, your lowered stats will return to normal. But if your stats have been boosted, they'll also return to normal. So watch out. Okay, good to know. <laughs> I can't get enough of spinning EV in 360 mode. Oh, nice. Long range attacks are good. Wait, did we just level up? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, leveled up. Okay. Moving along. So enemies do spawn back. So Nidoran. Uh oh. Oh, thank goodness. How do you turn the facing direction on the spot without moving? I would love to find out about that. Okay, we've got all the items. Let's head back. Okay. Oh no, we got a stat down. Okay, that's fine. Let's use this to restat. Yeah. Knowledge is power, yo. Let's run. Yeah, let's go. We got two more levels to go. Uh oh. You can change the leader. There we go. The Pokemon you control by pressing plus. You'll be able to control Pokemon other than just the hero. You can check how to play by pressing the negative button. You can find a lot of good tips for adventuring there. Okay, so let's change to Eevee. Uh oh! Okay, so let's... Um, I guess tackle. There we go. Nothing else inside this area. Oh, we found the stairs straight away. But let's clear out the dungeon. Okay. Nice. Oh, the EV just level up. Yeah. Just in time, leveled up. Okay, so Totodao is feeling a bit packaged soon. 
I guess whoever you use as leader, your hunger. <laughs> total down. I guess whoever you use as leader, your your hunger will actually decrease. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's switch to total down. Yeah, I just see somebody walk past us. Oh, it's a Nidoran. Uh oh. Oh no! Okay, let's stretch. Pokemon sometimes takes heavy damage when it takes actions while poisoned. The status wears off when Pokemon eats a Pekka Berry or moves to the next floor. Poison and Steel type Pokemon won't get this status. Oh no! No, 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 don't use it on me. Such a waste. I I'd rather take the damage. Oh no. Alright, so can we use this to reset the status effect? I guess not. Alright, so let's go down. Oh no, look at my health. Oh my goodness. Uh oh. Okay, let's press B and replenish our HP. Why is B not working? Okay, there we go. Uh, how many Oran Berries do we have? There we go. Uh oh. Okay, so Water Gun is a special move, so it's not affected by the Growl. There we go. So let's reset our status. Okay, Totodile is definitely getting hungry, so... Um, I should probably be feeding him. Okay, we found the stairs. Tiny Reviver Seed. So that's handy. There are more items here as well. Oh, oh no. Uh, water gun. What? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Nothing else here. Oh, it's a lead kit. Yeah, there we go. What? What did we just step on? Okay. Alright, the stairs is here. Let's go. There we go, we found the Magnemites. Oh, there they are. Let's get them out safely. I don't think I should be touching them because I'm a water type. Yeah, successfully completed the job at Thunder Wave Cake. Our body separated. Rejoice! Yay! Yay! Be thankful, you two. You are our heroes. Thank you. I like the way they move. They are like floating, but at the same time, they are bouncing. <laughs> I got a big apple. An Oran Berry? Yeah, more, more money? I'm glad our rescue mission went well today. Actually, since this was our first job as a proper rescue team, I was really tense and nervous. I'm exhausted now. I got to get some sleep. Let's keep our good work to keep up our good work tomorrow. I I can't read at this point of time. I'm really tired because it's after work. Uh oh well, I guess I have to go sleep with Evie as well. <laughs> Wait. Evie, you don't stay in the same place as me? I thought this hut was like our base that we huddle together. Hmm. Where... where am I? M maybe... is this a dream? Oh? There's someone here. Who is... someone I know? Hmm... I can't remember. I think I dreamt something? 
but I can't quite remember what that dream was about. Oh well, today is another day of rescues. I wonder if I have any mail, better check my mailbox. Alright, let's check out the hut. Loving the mini fountain that we have. And this crescent moon puddle. <laughs> oh, it's stuffed with something. Nice. Check the mailbox. But there was no mail seeking help from the rescue team. Huh? Yeah, good morning. Aren't you up early? Oh, so you checked the mailbox. Was there anything... You know? Uh, were there any rescue requests? Huh? Nothing? Hmm... I suppose that makes sense. We've only started... We've only started after... Shouldn't it be we've only just started after all? Huh. <laughs> well, too bad. Want to go Pokemon Square? I think if we go to the Pelipper Post Office, there'll be jobs posted. Pokemon Square is over this way. Let's go. Oh. We can go job hunting? This is Pokemon Square. Ooh. That's the Kecleon shop. You can buy and sell items there. That's Felicity Bank. <laughs> so the Persian is called Felicity. You can save your money there. This is the Galpin Link Shop. Oh, is this new? Galpin can link moves for you. Huh? What's linking? Well, if you link moves, you can use them together at the same time. What? Really? The last time I played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, there wasn't such a thing. Oh god, how long was that ago? <laughs> I think you should ask Galpin if you want to know more. Uh, okay, I guess I will do that on my own time. Oh look, this is the Kangaskhan store. Storage. If you store items here, they'll be safe. You should store important items here before you go out to a dungeon. Can't I do that at my base? And over there is the Makuhita Dojo. At the dojo, you can learn or get training on various maneuvers used in dungeons. What do you think? The businesses here help us? Oh, and there's also the Pelipper office, post office. That's up past here. I think we can get some information on rescue jobs. Let's first go to the Pelipper post office. Okay. That's such a mouthful. Your partner will tell you all kinds of things when you're not sure where to go. Just ask your partner. Okay. Let's go. This doesn't look like a post office. I heard features have opened up in the ground here and there. There are trouble for everyone. It worries me to no end. Thinking that children will fall down into them. Okay, so this is not the post office. Uh, where was it again? Yeah, we can run. <laughs> how does Totodo how does Totodo run on those stubby little legs? That building is the post office. Oh, is that a coconut? Oh no, it's not a coconut. That's a pretty cute design. This is where information is gathered from Pokemon needing rescue. See? Have a look at this bulletin board. It lists rescue jobs. Check it out! Alright. Tiny Woods Thunder Wave Cave. Oh, we have quite a bit of stuff to do. Wow! So, oh, the, the longest is four stories, I guess. Two stories. Huh. How many can we accept? Oh, we can accept all of them. Nice. 
Okay, so we can check them out as well. So PG might may be confused. Please someone help. So there's one from PG. I got separated from Plusle. Oh, so it's a different PG. I lost contact with Voltorb. Okay, so basically it's just rescuing people. See, uh, I mean not people, Pokemon. <laughs> I'm the only person. Right, I'm a total down now, so um, <laughs> there were jobs listed, right? To do a rescue job, choose the job and then go to the dungeon. That's indicated. You can go to the dungeons by taking the path near the base. Okay. Since we're just starting up, we should handle the jobs that are posted here. Our team name will get better known by doing that. I think that will bring us job offers to our mailbox. Yeah, it will be a lot easier to handle or rather accept job offers from our mailbox rather than coming all the way down here. Okay, so I guess the demo lets you play a certain number of missions, you know. So, yeah. So guys, I'm going to end it here. What do you guys think of our Pokemon Mystery Dungeon um, DX for the Nintendo Switch? Does it give you nostalgia if you have been playing the entire Mystery Dungeon series before? Well, for me, this is going to be a first full completion uh, experience. I'm definitely planning to complete this game. Uh, I did buy some of the mystery dungeon games in the past but I didn't get all of them because well I didn't really have a lot of time to play. I, I still don't but having the auto play function included into this game it's it's a lot a lot of help you know for someone who has a full-time job and of course YouTubing as a site uh, yeah, so definitely looking forward to this game. So let me guys, let me know guys what you guys think about this game in the comments down below. Leave a like to this video so that you guys can tell me whether you enjoyed this series and you would like to see it as a normal series on my YouTube channel in the future once I've gotten a copy of this game for myself. And thank you guys for joining me on this live stream. If you did not and you missed a chance, well, you can follow me on my YouTube Facebook page, links in the description as always. Join me there and of course keep updated to all the content that I usually post on the page. And of course like live streams like this. Um, I might move my live streams to YouTube in the future if they are content that YouTube approves and does not get flagged for copyright. So yeah, so guys, thank you guys so much as always and I'll see you guys soon. Until then, bye!